The Pilatus PC-24 is fully capable of creating, entering, and flying holds, as well as generating offset courses. The aircraft can fly holding patterns that are defined as part of a procedure or created manually by the pilot. To enter a hold into a flight plan, click on the desired waypoint in the waypoint list or on the iNav map. From the drop-down menu, select Hold. The Hold dialog box will be displayed. The Hold dialog box contains all the information regarding the hold and is used to create, modify, or delete a hold. When the Hold dialog box for a waypoint is first accessed, default holding parameters will be shown. If a waypoint has a published hold, the published holding parameters will be shown by default. To fly a hold as published or with the default holding parameters, simply click on Apply. If necessary, changes can be made to the default values to match the hold clearance. Enter the radial or the inbound course. The radial field is only available when the hold is at a VOR or TACAN. Modify the default leg time or distance as necessary. When one field is adjusted, the other changes accordingly. Change the turn direction if necessary. Clicking on the As Published button will reset the parameters to the published hold. The preview window will show a drawing of the currently defined hold. In addition, the quadrant and hold entry are shown. If the hold is along an airway, the airway name will be shown here. Set the holding speed. Currently, the max endurance option is not available. Once holding parameters are set, click on Apply. The hold will be added to the pending flight plan and will be displayed in Cyan on the iNav map. Click Activate. Once the hold is activated, an H will be displayed next to the waypoint. The holding pattern will also be drawn to scale on the iNav map. If the entry is a teardrop or parallel, the entry will also be drawn. Once the aircraft reaches the holding fix, it will begin the holding entry. The FMS determines the hold entry to keep the aircraft in the protected area while minimizing maneuvering during the entry process. During teardrop or parallel entries, the length of the outbound leg will be adjusted so that a 45-degree intercept to the inbound course can be achieved based on the ground speed. After the entry is completed, the entry is removed from the iNav map and the aircraft is established in the hold. To exit the hold, select Exit Hold. The aircraft will fly back to the holding fix before sequencing to the next waypoint in the flight plan. You will have the option to resume the hold during this process. You can also exit a hold at any time by performing a direct to. Another holding feature is the present position hold. Click on the aircraft symbol on the iNav map. Select Aircraft and then Present Position Hold. The hold window will be displayed with default holding parameters. Changes can be made if necessary. Click on Apply to enter the hold immediately. A temporary waypoint will be created at the aircraft's present position and will act as the holding fix. Fly and exit the hold as you would a normal holding pattern. An offset course is a course that runs parallel to the current aircraft course. An offset course can be useful when trying to avoid weather, traffic, or wake turbulence. To enter an offset course, click on the aircraft symbol. From the Select Object menu, click on Aircraft and then Offset. In the Offset dialog box, enter the desired direction and distance of the offset. An offset can be entered up to 30 miles left or right of the current course. Click on Apply, then Activate. 
Once the offset is entered, the aircraft will turn to intercept the offset course. When flying an offset course, the cross-track annunciation is displayed on the PFD to remind the pilot that the aircraft is flying an offset course. The CDI will indicate a deviation from the calculated offset course and, as a result, will be centered when the aircraft is established on the offset course. To delete the offset course, return to the Offset dialog box and click on Delete. The aircraft will turn back to intercept the original course. When entering an offset, if the next waypoint in the flight plan is part of a procedure such as a star or an approach, the FMS message, Offset Cancel Next Waypoint, will be displayed. In this case, the offset course will be automatically cancelled when the next waypoint is sequenced. This is because lateral offsets are not available when flying procedures such as SIDs, STARS, approaches, or holding patterns. They are also not available in polar regions or the terminal area of an airport. The terminal area is 10 miles from the origin airport and within 25 miles of the destination airport. An offset will also be automatically deleted if there is a course change greater than 90 degrees.